Hello Shopify merchants, this is Basil here. In this video, I want to walk through how to set up your bundle options for Infinite Options Bundle. Uh, there are multiple ways you can set up these option groups as well as options. So I'm gonna go through um, how to set up a, an option group as well as multiple options within an option group. Uh, so in this example, I have a build your own jewelry bundle. And in this jewelry bundle, there's three separate products uh, with colors. So you can see that I have a chakra bracelet here, a bracelet men's color, uh, and then just a gemstone necklace. And each of these have separate colors. So because each of these uh, options gives one product uh, or uh, yields one product, I have actually selected these as separate option groups and not in the same option. So I wouldn't add it here. I've added these as separate option groups. And what this allows me to do now is like once I've configured these options, and let's make sure it once I preview, this is exactly what I want, I want my customers to see, uh, these various options here. And if I go down and click on continue to add products, I will see all those different options that I added with the uh, color for that bracelet, uh, with the um, ability to add the product for that option. So I've gone ahead and already added that, so as you can see. Um, another way to sort of look at this is to think about, um, let me actually scroll all the way down here to reconfigure these options. And here you can see that I have a um, bundle here uh, with the uh, t-shirt size and t-shirt color option set up in the same option group. And the reason for this is that a t-shirt size and a t-shirt color yields one product. So here I can select a small uh, as well as a red, so which will read a, lead to a red small uh, t-shirt. Uh, so if I click on preview bundle options, it looks something like this. So I have option to select my t-shirt size and t-shirt colors. Um, and that's why it's in the exact same option group. And any other option options for that um, for the product or the bundle would also be another option group like pants, which are sort of separate. I can also have a hat, which is also separate, but only has one option within the option group. And again, one option for the sock size here. So uh, if I was to go and click on continue to add products, what this does is that it takes the all the options in an option group and sort of multiplies them or creates every single combination of those. So here you can see that there's a small red, uh, small, small t-shirt blue color and I'll have to go in and add a product for that combination. Another way to think about it is to think about an and uh, condition between these different options. So when a merchant was to select uh, a small or a medium and a blue, these in combination will lead to a specific product. Um, so yeah, that's it for uh, setting up these bundle options. I'm actually gonna use this as an example to go through the entire flow. So once I've already set up all these products here, um, I can click on save, make sure it's all saved here. Um, so I can actually jump into my product and you'll see like none of these options are actually configured because I haven't actually installed this. So what I can do is jump into my preferences and jump to the theme preferences section. Uh, and here I can select my uh, theme. Only my published theme is gonna show here. So I'm already uh, selecting my uh, current published theme, which is minimal. And I'm gonna go ahead and click on install product uh, template. So as soon as I do that, uh, it gives me some instructions here um, to enable this uh, theme template on the product. So let's go back here and uh, Let's see, let me refresh the page to make sure I can see the simple one. Yep, yeah, looks like it's already activated there. So within the online store theme template, uh, if I go back into my product and click on refresh, I should see the options show up here. So I can go ahead and select these options and then click on add to cart. So let's select this purple. And I should see these options added to my um, cart as well. So if these don't work, there's something, uh, um, probably wrong with the setup. And of course, reach out to us and we can help with that. And you can click on checkout, which will add it to your um, checkout as well. And you should see these options as well. So once you finish this checkout, you should see all of these added uh, in your um, order, uh, as well as all the appropriate products uh, added into your um, uh, order as well. And of course, you can see these options added edited by Simple Bundles. So if you have any questions, reach out to us and we'd be happy to help. Thanks.